Okay, so some everyday uses for cycloalkanes. Um, the very long chains, like C16, H34, and longer, are solids, and they are called waxes or paraffins. Now here are some practice questions. So you'll want to pause the video here while you work out the questions, and we'll see you in a couple minutes with the answers. Alrighty, and now that you've got that, we'll figure out the answers. Okay, so we know it is a cyclo something because it's a circle. And there is one, two, three, four, five, six. So it would be a cyclohexane. And there is an ethyl, and we'll just make that number one. So one ethyl cyclohexane. All right. Now down to here, again, we'll know it's a cyclo something or other. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's a cyclohexane. And then we can have a 1-ethyl-2-methyl. Okay, that says 1-ethyl-2-methyl cyclohexane, in case you can't read that. And then the answer's over here. All right, it's a cyclopentane. On one, there are two methyls, so C and C. There you go, one one dimethyl cyclopentane. And then here we've got a long one, one three diethyl two two dimethyl cyclooctane. So it's an octane in a circle. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then on, we'll start one here. I go clockwise. So there's two ethyls. One, two, three. Here's the other one. Then on two, there are two methyls. And there you go.